right, so here is Dustin Poirier making the walk for yet another big UFC spot here tonight. UFC 236 was his coming out party, DC. He ended Max Holloway's 13-fight winning streak, and in a near-perfect performance in a lot of respects, was able to realize a UFC interim lightweight. They say diamonds are forever, and so is Dustin Poirier. It seems like he's been here the whole time. We've seen this young man grow up in the UFC. We saw him at 145 pounds have a ton of success, but we've truly seen him come into his own as he's going up to lightweight. He's become a UFC interim champion, and he's beaten guys like Eddie Alvarez, Justin Gaethje, and Max Holloway. One of the best fighters at 155 is Dustin Poirier. And with Dustin Poirier and Daniel Cormier, safe to say that Lafayette, Louisiana has made a pretty good UFC football over the last three years. Dustin Poirier. Mike Tyson's in the game, ladies and gentlemen. Last boxing competition for him against Kevin McBride in 2005. He loves this mixed martial arts stuff. You know about his appetite for competition. This field, this felt like an eventuality. Tyson on the biggest stage tonight. Yeah, it always felt like Mike Tyson would make his way here because he loves fighting so much. And he loves mixed martial arts so much. But if you ever thought a guy could cross over from boxing with the athleticism, you thought it was Iron Mike Tyson. He was so fast, he was so gifted. He's an A-plus athlete. And if he commits himself to the wrestling like he did boxing, I imagine Tyson will find a lot of success inside the octagon. Once the baddest man on the planet, trying to realize that distinction again, albeit in a different combat sports setting. We'll see how it goes for Iron Mike tonight. to make another major statement here tonight. And now let's get you our tail of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. All right, now for the particulars, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. Herb Dean, he will handle the action inside the octagon. All right, so here he is, formerly the baddest man on the planet, former boxing heavyweight champion, Iron Mike Tyson. Look for him to move forward. You know the flurries are coming. He'll employ that signature peekaboo style as he tries to get inside. Takedown defense could be tested. I mean, that's what opponents are going to be looking to do. They're going to try to take Mike Tyson down. Easier said than done. Dan Blake will get missed this fight. Both fighters throwing oh, That's a huge connection there, DC. He massive, is hurt. Massive hook lands. And this is. Oh! Oh! Well, informed speculation says he's going to try to set up another hook here. Fourier's strike there is blocked. Nice job by the defense. And there's a takedown attempt. Big right hand from the American top team train, Dustin Poirier. So many outstanding coaches out there, not the least of which is Mike Brown, who finds himself firmly in Poirier's corner, as usual here tonight. All right, he's been very clean with his hooks on the feet here tonight, and it's the way he set it up that has really impressed you. Yeah, it's very impressive to see him pop the jab, pop the jab. Oh, he smells blood in the water. Got to start looking for the finish here. We might get a stoppage here. 
Yes, smart adjustment. Yep. Gotta keep your hands up for me now. He's got to start throwing now. All right, north south position here. We'll see if the crowd can be mature about this, DC. Oh, that Kimura looks tight. Good job by the champ there. Sliding back out. Tyson gets back up. Oh, they're trading huge shots here. We'll see who's the last man standing. Oh, nice punch there by Poirier. He's got to start kicking. Kicking the body, kicking the head. He's just got to start kicking. All right, gets inside, gets the single collar tie here. Takedown defense holds up. Oh, oh he's stunned bad. He's got to grab him. He's got to recover. Oh, oh. Power shots landing on both sides. And the chins continue to hold up. Perfect shot there, DC, and one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is going to be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That I shot got... landed perfect. Forty-five seconds to go here in round one. Poirier's in half court. Great ground and pound by this man. All right, working on the ground here. His opponent's feet on the hips. Wow, he actually reversed the position. Poirier's going for a choke. Oh, he's in trouble. Oh, and there's the horn at the end of the round. How about this fight, folks? You see, he was nearly caught in a submission there right at the end of the round, saved by the bell. So back to the stool, mentally probably not in a great place here. We'll see if he can recover and get himself back into this fight. All right, so there's the horn. He got knocked down by a punch in that round, but he is able to survive. We'll see if they can make some adjustments. He's as tough as they come. He took that shot and he kept plodding forward. He got off of his butt. He got himself off of the canvas and tried to get right back to work. But he cannot take many more of these. You don't want to be the guy that's testing how tough that your chin is. Ready. Ready. All right, second round underway. Oh! Back to the feet. Oh, there it is. That's that one, that right hand. All right, well, he rocked him pretty good, but didn't sort of smell. That'll do it. Oh, my goodness. I mean, you gotta be kidding me with that knockout. If that is not the number one play on Sports Center tonight, I'm not sure what would top it. One of the best knockouts we've seen all year. In a very long time. I have not seen someone look this good. He promised us something and he delivered with that beautiful knockout. All right, the official decision is in. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at 28 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Iron Mike Tyson. So, big UFC win for Iron Mike Tyson here tonight. Words you probably thought you'd never hear, but since crossing over from boxing, it has been all systems.